Hello, everybody, and welcome to a Matchroom Monday in partnership with London United. I am Curbs, and you may know me from YouTube and Twitch. If you don't, I'll leave those links down in the description. But enough about me. We are joined today by one of the best darts players in the world. It is Mr. Devin Peterson. How are you, mate? What's happening, Curbs? Uh, I'm great. I just landed in Blackpool now, and I'm excited to have this game with you today. Oh, as am I, mate. Like, I have a really good team on FIFA at the moment, and it's full of English players. I'm still a little bit hurt after the Euros, so oh. I thought it's probably for the best that I get to use them one last time and feel good about using them uh, in this game. But uh, we are going to have a FIFA showdown match today, but we have 11 questions for, for you to answer today. And for each question that you answer correctly, you get to take out one of these players in my team. So are you looking forward to it, and are you confident for it? Yeah, I just wanted to... Just a disclaimer, I'm a, a, a part-time FIFA, not even a player. I'm, I'm, a, yeah, I'm, a, I'm a holder of a joystick, if you must call it that. So I'm no, I'm no professional like yourself, but I am going to give it a go. And yeah, like everything, I, I am confident. So if I can if I can at least answer seven questions correctly, I could, I could probably disable the kind of team that you have. And it might just put the, 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 the kind of advantage in my favor. Oh, I respect it, but well, to put seven players in my bronze team, that is going to absolutely mud me if I'm going to be honest with you. But hey, <laughs> let's get into the first question, shall yeah, we? Let's and go, let's, uh, go. let's get into it. Let's test your knowledge. So, question number one London Calling and Crazy Crazy Nights were used as walk on songs by which former world champion? Wow. Former world champion? Yes. Um, a tough one to start. We'd love to see it. Wow, London Knights. Eric Bristol, maybe? Is that your final answer? Um, who else is their world champ that could have... It's a crazy... crazy. Yeah. All right, thought I'd just give you a chance just in case, but no, you are correct with Eric Bristow, mate. Well done, you've got your first chance at my team. And I guess we'll the do legend. this after the questions are completed. Obviously, got to be Eric Bristow for that one there. Okay, question number two for the chance at a second player going out of my team already, which is fantastic, though. Michael Jordan's leaping ability earned him which nickname? Hey, Jordan. And you are right yet again. I'm smiling, but I'm also uh, I'm also <laughs> knowing that I've already got two players out of my team, which is it's just not gone well for me. It's all so bad. So that <laughs> two is out of two. Two out of two. two, out two. Out five more to go. Come on. Absolutely smashing it, mate. Right. Question number three. In which year was the world match play first held? Um. What is that? Probably 1998. You are incorrect on that one, mate. It was actually 1994. Not too far oh, away, no. but it was 94. Right. I get to have one gold player. We love to see it. Right, come on. <laughs> Let's go. I'm happy. Right, next question, though. Can you name the player that famously jumped over the barrier to fight a fan in the Premier League? Eric Cantona. Absolutely smashed it. Yes, you have. That's uh, three correct for you, mate. Well done. Well done. Uh, I, I would uh, congratulate you even more, but I, my team is just getting absolutely disguised. <laughs> not a good day. It's not a good day at the office for me, but come well on, done. Come that on, one was more, Eric Cantona. Next question. In the 2020 German Darts Championship final, Devin Peterson defeated Johnny Clayton by what score? Um... Oh, you gotta know this one, mate. Come on, well, you you were you were in it. Sure. What's that? Uh, <laughs> eight three. Correct. Of course it is. Eight uh, eight three. You defeated Johnny Clayton by so. Congratulations right. for that as well, mate. Well done. That's four <laughs> players out of my team. Oh, this is this has not gone well. Oh, knowledge is, is up there, mate. Absolutely respect it. Next question though. Who scored the Premier League winning goal for Manchester City against Queens Park Rangers? Aguero. Wow, I, I, you've actually just done... So I'm, a, I'm a Man United fan as well, and you've low-key just done that. <laughs> I don't believe it. Oh, I've actually... Uh, but yes, no, it was Sergio Aguero. A young Cubs was uh, not very happy that day, and tears were flooding down the cheeks. I can't... Uh, I, can, uh... I remember I was practising on that day, and yeah. I had two t I had a TV on and my iPad. I'm watching it when Man United, kind of the game ended, and just yeah. looking, and just seeing their faces, it was uh, brilliant for me. 
not not a good day for me and all the all the United <laughs> boys, I must say. But hey, it is what it is. Uh, next question though. To the nearest thousand on this one, how many different ways are there to throw a nine darter? To the nearest thousand? I yes. think it's 3,000, it's, no, it's 3,600. So I think it's 3,600. Mm. And it's nine. Actually, yeah. The correct answer is 3,944. So it rounds up to 4,000 on that one. That was 3,600, so that would give me a round up 4,000, is it? 4,000, yeah. So I will give you that one, because you did say 3,600. If you were anything below 3,500, I would not have yeah. given you it, just so I've got two players. But no, you did say 3,600, so I'll let you round up to 4,000 on that one. So well done, mate. Love to see it. <laughs> Oh, I'm literally going to have no team. This, uh, this is uh, this is dreadful. This is dreadful for me. Uh, Don't worry, you'll still beat me. You'll still probably give me a massive game with the skill ability you guys have. So hopefully. I'm sure you'll you'll be able to. Do it. Hopefully, otherwise it's just a bad day at the office for me all round. I've had Aguero <laughs> screamed at me in my ear, bringing back really bad flashbacks. So I'm going to get beaten. It's it's not good. However, we do have some more questions. Who is the all-time leading goal scorer in the Premiership? All time. All time record goal scorer. Could that be? Um, all, the one, would... all the football fans watching this are screaming at their screens right now. Is it all time? Could it be? Is it, is it Alan Shearer? It is indeed. With how long right. you took me that one, I didn't think you were going to get that one. Oh, dearie me. Fair enough. Another correct answer, mate. I, I, I genuinely think I have one goal player as of right now. So uh, if you fancy getting the last few wrong, that'd be I'd, I'd greatly appreciated. I can't lie to you. Uh, but three questions to go by the look of it. And uh, with three to go, this is, this is coming up. In which year did Colin Lloyd win the world match play? 2001. Oh, it's not. It's 2005. Yes. Yes. Two goal players for me. Let's go. I'm actually, I'm, I'm at the point now where I'm, I'm celebrating if you get a question wrong, just so I can get the <laughs> players. Oh, it's brilliant. Okay, right. Your penultimate question, Devon. What is the highest scoring point you can score in basketball? Three-pointer. That is correct. Nice. Very, very nice indeed. Smashed it. Didn't, didn't even need time to think. Absolutely smashed it. And Devon. Some of the questions are so simple, but tricky though. Yeah, this is true. It, it's one of those, like, you can really, it's like a really easy to slip up on, isn't it? So, yeah, yeah, it's like a gimme class, but you can miss yeah. it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, exactly, yeah, exactly. Okay, for your final question, Devon, with what checkout did Rob Cross win the World Championship? 140. Oh, he smashed it, it is 140. Well yeah. done, mate. You have absolutely smashed out those questions, mate. Um, I believe you only got, what, two wrong of the entire 11 that we've just asked you? Not um, bad. So I will be using two decent players and uh, nine bronze players. So thank you for that, mate. <laughs> Great. Not a problem. It's only <laughs> in my best interest to be um, quite... Uh, intelligent or knowledgeable about those oh. questions because i know that how good you are on the God, on go. the paper so of yeah course, any mate, advantage I'll, uh, i can have i'll take that that's kind of don't worry about it though like if you lose i mean who's gonna watch this probably a few thousand people so yeah, it's okay yeah, yeah. exactly yeah i'll just be, be a complete meme amongst the feedback I'll, I'll only share it to show some to all my social media platforms and all of those things don't worry about Love that it's not a lot appreciate it mate Th thanks a lot thanks a lot well um <laughs> The ball is now in your court, so to speak. Um, I can let you know what my team is, and then you can choose two players which I can keep, if uh, if that works for you. You so, can keep your goalkeeper, it's fine. Oh, thank you. So Dean Henderson, my boy from Man United, we'd love to see it. Yeah, uh, and you I'll can go keep through, him, it's fine. I'll go through and then my team. I will give you, I will give you the... I'm currently in a 4-3-3. I'll give you your... You'll probably use Kyle Walker on the left wing, on the left back. So I'll give you Kyle Walker as well, if you have him. Thank you very much. I was actually using Kieran Trippier and my boy Luke Shaw. Uh, so would you? Yeah, like I thought, I thought Shaw would be Shaw would be in your team, but I thought you'd probably use Kyle Walker for the pace. But yeah, if you if yeah. your left back, whoever your left back is, take him out. Take him out. 
Lovely. Oh, well, keep him, keep him. Keep no, him. keep him. Luke Shaw. The rest, lovely. the rest you can just throw mad on, basically. My, my boy that uh, that that scored for us in the in the uh, Euro 2020 final. Unfortunately, we did not win. Well, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, I've got Dean Henderson and Luke Shaw trying to uh, trying to win me the game against Devon today. Let us know your predictions down in the comments. And Devon, let's get into this FIFA showdown match. Yes. Here we are, then, Devon. We're currently in one of the uh, one of the Foot Champ stadiums, mate. As of recording this video, before we do get into the FIFA side of things, the World Match Play, your debut is coming up. How are you feeling for it, mate? It's something that I've dreamed about for so many years. I mean, I've, I've watched, I've watched it over um, probably the last could be 15 years, and you wow. realize now like how crazy, how crazy it is to actually be playing. Like I, when I was driving to Blackpool, it was like I'm actually gonna play in the, in, in the match play. It's something that we used to watch on VHS. Um, oh, and yeah. now I get a chance to actually have a debut in it, which is great. So yeah, I actually feel I feel like um, I'm ready. I think I've, I've put everything in place that I possibly needed to put in place um, to perform at my ultimate best. And yeah, it's it's gonna be it's gonna be a challenge, but it's a challenge that I accept and a challenge that I've been working hard towards. So yeah, I'm, I'm really excited. I think that is probably the as as. The only word that can define it, though, really, is just pure excitement. It's love to oh, see no. it, mate. Well, I do wish you the best of luck, as I've almost taken the lead there with a bronze player, which I'm fuming stop, about. I should have put it away. Stop saying that on the bronze player, because I mean, you could turn up with a with a with a with a, a half a team as well, and probably still be. Uh, we'll have to see how it that, gets on, mate. Oh dear. Well, that, that's definitely not good. Oh, big save. Absolutely love that from the keeper. Big Dean Hendo. Love that from you, mate. Luke, Luke Shaw has just been sold. Oh, my body's on the line. Oh, Dean Henderson. We love to see it. Oh, here we are. Luke it's Shaw. Done. Man of Euro 2020 for me. It's a terrible... Oh, what is that touch, mate? Have a day off. Oh, it's, that's a cruncher. Oh dear. This is, uh, this is not going to go well. Oh, you, you've got Jesus every day of the week. Go on, like, no, never mind. You see that block? Oh, that is <laughs> unbelievable! What? what a block that is! Oh, that, that's unbelievable. Let's get let's right. get going. Let's get something moving. Yeah, come on, boys. Uh, so Maximan ain't going anywhere when French is about, mate. He's a rock at the back, and Scotty P going through the mid. Oh, gone in Karamoko. Yeah. Oh, we love to see it, Karamoko. Karamoko, what a name. What a name. That should be it like is. a drink, though, shouldn't it? Yeah, it really should, yeah. A, a large oh. Karamoko, please. <laughs> <laughs> oh, brilliant. Oh, oh. Get, get on it. Mate, Gareth Bale's absolutely just flat and Luke Shaw. Oh, dear. Well, this is not good. It's him. No! No. He's actually... He's... Yeah. <laughs> I don't believe That's it. Yeah. I've just conceded a sweaty. I don't believe it. Oh my god! Well, that's, that's not allowed, is it? <laughs> that is that is unsportsmanship to score a sweaty. <laughs> <laughs> no, you know what? If it was me in, this, in my is, position, I would is, do it as well. Anything to win, mate. That is that is what it is. Of course, yeah. That's how you know when you're playing against a, uh, a professional athlete. <laughs> They're like, yeah, no, I don't care. I'm winning. <laughs> that's all I want to do. Exactly. Oh, no. Falkingham. Oh, he's missed it. Dean Henderson has there. saved me. Right, off we go. Oh, no, that's lovely. Oh, that is lovely. Little Re turn on a 10 right. cent. All I'm going to say, really referee, cool. you've added one minute of time and there's three minutes on the clock. What's going on there then, huh? Love to see it. Carol Oh, here we go. Oh, French, French has not kept up with the... <laughs> <laughs> Man trying to double sway. What am I seeing? Exactly, mate. If in doubt, get that thing out. Love to see it. Off we I'm go. Just... Scotty P. That's it. And the drag back. Oh, we love to see it. No, we don't love that pass, though. We don't love it at all. I'll tell you what, you got some good counter-attacks on the go. Oh, uh, what is that ball? What on earth have I just seen? Oh, Hey, Devon, mate, we got we got to have a conversation about you bottling these chances, mate. 
No, I'm just, I'm just exploiting the avenues. That's all it is. Story True, mate. Is the easy part. True. You're absolutely tearing me apart, mate. On this one, I can't lie to you. Right, I call it Luke Shaw. I need, I need you. Oh, here we go. <gasps> Karamoko, he's in. Oh, he oh! scored as well. <laughs> yeah, our boy it's Karamoko Dembele. Go on, lad. What a finish. It's the Karamoko. Hey, it's it's the the man the man the myth that well I say the man the boy the myth the legend at the minute because I don't think he's eighteen. <laughs> we need to get you in, in mate. That's lovely oh, defending. Yeah. My striker. Oh dear. Right. Come on, get across. Oh, it's a lovely goal. It is lovely. I'm not <laughs> even going to celebrate or anything like that. It's just <laughs> Liverpool's striker. Liverpool. Diego yeah. Jota. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, today's not gone well. I've had the Aguero meme at me, and now I've had Diogo Jota score against me. As a Man United fan, it's not been a good day at the office. Oh, Diego Jota. I like him. It's a proper He's satisfying name killer. to say. Do you say well, you support it? Man United? Uh, yes, I do, yeah. What about yourself? Yeah, who, who do you support? I support Liverpool. Fair enough, mate. Fair enough. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah. So you're the... very happy scoring that one there. Yeah. <laughs> It's, he's the he's our boy as well, so he's oh no, that's pathetic. Exactly. That wasn't meant to be true. Right, but yeah, he's right. he's he's been been good. I think um, Sancho signing for Man United. What, what's your feeling on that? Oh, I'm so excited. We haven't had a good right winger for God knows how many years. Oh, Karamoko has overrun that one. Yeah, no, very very excited, especially with the the prospects of looking like we're getting maybe Rafa Varane as well. I think him yeah. next to Harry, Harry Maguire might be really, really good for us next season. As long as that yeah. obviously comes off, which from the likes of Fabrizio Romano and some other good tier one, um, <clears throat> it's, it, yeah, it's looking I think, good. I think, I think next season is going to be great because the guy's obviously yeah. having some time off and all of that stuff as well now. Yeah. So hopefully the... Oh, here we oh. go. Go on then, bang that. Oh, it's good keeping. Hugo Lloris. 88th minute, looking like it's going to be the final action of the game. Let's see what we can do. Scotty P, off you go. Lovely. That's a lovely ball. No idea who this is on the left. Not the ball we were after. Oh, dear. And now I've given you an opportunity in the last minute. Oh, dear. Come on, French. Come on, son. You've got to get to him. It's only Diogo Jota. Who even is he? It's him. That's 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 very nice. Oh dear, <laughs> I, yeah, I have been royally mugged off today. It has not gone well. Devon has absolutely smashed it, mate. It's a it's a big GG's. Tyson has uh, not given my uh, my right back a good day at the office. But there you go, mate. That is full time. Big big GG's, mate. But uh, ladies and gentlemen, thank you all for tuning in to another Match Room Monday. I've had a lot of fun today with Devon, and of course, it's in partnership with. London United as well. I hope you guys have enjoyed today's episode. Make sure to hit the like button. Subscribe if you are new. Let us know who you would like to see in the future um, in the comments section down below. I've been Curbs. You've been Devon. He's the champ today. Thank you for watching and goodbye.